advanced 5-axis improvement enables the minimum size of profile ramps to be controlled by a parameter. This helps to avoid small profile ramps and makes it possible to use tools with wider non-cutting areas. It also improves the efficiency with which tools engage, and larger ramps mean less ramping time. The line ramps are now trimmed according to the stock. This ensures that the length of the ramps is defined appropriately according to the available stock. This new enhancement optimizes the start points for closed contours in the multi-axis roughing strategy, reducing the number of ramps. This means that some ramps are removed, with the tool engaging from previously cut passes in these cases. This reduces the total cycle time of the operation while extending tool life. Some parts, such as cylindrical cams, can have their surfaces geometrically machined using flank milling on a relatively inexpensive four-axis machine. However, it is difficult to optimally align the tool with the surfaces when machining with a tool smaller than the slot. This enhancement improves part accuracy, reduces machining costs and offers greater flexibility in selecting tool diameters. This feature allows users to define tool tilting using a tool segment when working with advanced tools, such as barrel tools. This gives users greater control over the tilting range and the tool's contact point during operations. This feature enables the tool to extend its motion beyond the start and end points of each closed contour. This reduces the size of the cusps at the start and end points, particularly when using advanced tools such as barrel tools, and produces clean surfaces. The new floor parallel cutting pattern for wall finishing produces slices that are parallel to the floor, ensuring that any features on the wall do not disrupt the generation of the pattern. This introduces a whole new range of geometries that can be machined with less tilting for a better surface finish. For more information visit www.edgecam.com